everybody welcome back to the channel in this video I'm going to show you the new features of Roku OS 10.5 you're asking yourself what is Roku OS Roku OS is a Linux system that runs on the Roku streaming boxes it is a proprietary OS that runs on the Roku box. So, as you can see, mine is in the screensaver, so I'm going to get it out of the screensaver. All right, so um, I was out, came home, and this popped up on the screen. So, I'm at the latest version, and there are new features. So, here are some of the new features that come with th th this OS update you use your voice to play music and podcasts it's almost like Siri or Katana where you could say hey whatever or say open this you could use it to open up Spotify you could do podcasts and all that so the approved wireless private listening faster email password entry with Roku voice on the Roku remote here you have this and there is a speaker right here which is also a microphone and it will answer that so it's it, it will only listen for your voice if you push this so you could do Roku voice search available within channels that is really cool you could say hey or say hey channel 2 and much more so let's see what's new So, and there's a video here showing you. there you go so now what I can do is I could change screen saver and I could do all that so if I click home I'll go to settings here ooh here's a really cool thing you could do network remote device I could set up I can use di different remotes. I bought one that was specific for the Roku, but there are some that you could program. You could do it with this. I could do the theme. I could do display type, which ironically, this matches my TV. Accessibility. I could do home screen. Here's the cool thing. I could stream my Apple devices through this. Which means if you do not have a smart TV, I could airplay it on the Roku. So let's try that now. Let's see if anything comes up. All right, so AirPlay is on for the Roku. So let's see. If this will work, let's see if my iPhone will see this. So what I'm going to do is close everything out. All right, so I'm going to push this. Let's see if the Roku will see it. All right, so it's not. So I'm going to have to do a little troubleshooting on that. But that's fine. So I'll go back. So 
So I can do a theme. So we have different theme theme packs you can get. So I have, you know, default. I was going to see if I could download some more. But let's do a space. You have to enter a code to do it. It's almost like um, when you download something from the App Store on your iPhone, you're going to do the same thing. All right, so set theme pack. I'm going to see if there's... Ooh, this is cool. So we'll go back. Screensaver. That's the screensaver right now, so let's view it. We could do the preview just like in Windows. And they put ads in there just. Pretty cool. Go back, go back. I could do featured screensaver. That's the default one. I don't really particularly care for that one. Then there's seasonal themes. So I have that. Uh, didn't you have accessibility? Um, I you could turn closed caption on, which oh well that's interesting. It looks like a test pattern. I could do, you could change the text. Let's do text color. So on this, that's what that was. I thought it was a test pattern. It's not. It's showing you the different colors you could change for the um, test pattern. The closed caption, excuse me. So since my favorite color is blue, I'm going to set it to blue. And if you have a vision impairment, you could uh, magnify it. Background capacity. You could do text style. There's different there's even different fonts and stuff like that. Volume. Now the reason I set the volume to high here's my take on this stuff. Your TV has a volume and your viewing source, whether it be a cable box or a streaming box, also has a volume. You always set the source to the highest, and you use the TV volume. And now, if it gets the sound gets distorted, you, you uh, adjust the volume on the source, and you leave that alone. Uh, screen reader, volume shortcut. Now, if we go to system. This is really cool. So, 12 hour, auto launch. Go 
go back. And then you have a TV store. You can go to. And it gives you certain things that you can do. So anyway, with that said, that is it for this video. Please comment, like, subscribe, and click that bell for more notifications.